There may come a time when you decide to build a large bookcase like this, or maybe you go to a store and buy one. Here's the problem. When you load bookcases with books, they're very narrow, and they can become top-heavy, and if you're not careful, they can tip over. Someone could get injured very easily. The key is to attach the bookcase to the wall. A couple of options. You can use a screw or a nail and drive it through the back, but that kind of looks tacky. I don't like to do it that way. I like to use a L bracket that actually hides behind the bookcase and you don't even see it. How do you do it? Go ahead and draw a little thin pencil line where the bookcase touches the wall. I'm talking about the top of the bookcase. This is your reference mark. Move the bookcase out of the way. Go ahead and install the L bracket so that the bottom of the top of the L bracket is flush with the pencil line. This allows you to slide the bookcase back into position and the top of the L bracket just touches the top of the bookcase. At that point, take a hammer and a nail, drive a little hole through the center of the holes in the top of the L bracket. That allows you to put a screw into the L bracket that secures the bookcase to the wall. Believe me, it keeps the bookcase nice and tight. Oh yeah, that thing's not going anywhere. Another quick tip. Remember, the screw that you use to go through the top of the bookcase into the L bracket has got to be pretty short. We don't want it to show through the wood. Do all those things, and you're going to have a nice, safe bookcase in your home. If you want to discover more home improvement tips, go to askthebuilder.com.